from the Philippines and I'm Phoenix and together, together we're Phil's to Phoenix two countries one, one heart. heart and I'm Cindy and I'm John and welcome to the Monday, Monday night, night Chica Chica, Chica. Chica. The, this week Cindy's actually been kind of busy at work yeah she's been doing a bunch of overtime that they're beginning all the end of the year payroll stuff and all that funness. Yeah, maintenance, corrections, updating address, and uh, entering the bonuses, uh, health insurance, and all the benefits to all the employees. So yeah, it's more of uh, payroll plus maintenance plus and plus and plus projects. So it's that's crazy. It's crazy days. So yeah. And this week I got to do some brochure, uh, design a brochure for the Jack Harris Foundation that we're working with. Yeah. And that actually went kind of cool. Wednesday night we had a uh, phone conference meeting. Yeah, that's Wednesday. Yeah. With uh, Elizabeth, the CEO, and, Me and Dennis, you. the president that lives in Seattle, which is why we wind up doing the phone conferences. Yep. And then Cindy and I. Yep. Uh and the one perk to her working overtime is instead of giving overtime, it's, it, it's at the end of the year, so the budget's all gone for overtime. They're giving her comp time, and that meant she got off at three, 4 o'clock. Right? Yeah, 4 o'clock mountain time, because we use specific time. Right. Yeah, it's confusing. We go to lunch so early, but yeah, we get a chance. We get... The, the chance to watch the uh, Star Wars, The Last Jedi. On opening day. Yes. In 3D. Yes, it was awesome. It was a really good experience. It's like for real. But that was actually pretty cool. That We enjoyed that. And and take note, I give up my fish for exchange for gift cards. <laughs> At Cindy's work, she gets... Uh, fit the, these little stuffed fish for perks. Yeah, if you have a client sending an email, hey, you did a good job, that's the survey, so um, they're satisfied to the, to the service I gave. So yeah, it was really cool. And you can trade them in for gift cards? Yes, yeah, so for 10 gift cards, uh, for 10 fish, it's $10 gift cards, so. So you get a buck of fish. Yeah, so you get like $60 gift cards. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Like she had an aquarium going. Yeah, I feel like I'm super rich with those. Yeah, I know some people. You have your own version of rich, but I have my own version version of rich. So. Hey, yeah. sixty dollars for free is is still sixty bucks. I know if you convert it in Philippine peso, you're rich. <laughs> you could it's get, fifty to one. Yeah. <laughs> of course, you could get a box of rice. One sack of rice, two sacks of rice. There you go. Yeah. So yeah. So, anyways, moving forward. <laughs> um, what else we do? Saturday morning, we had another meeting that we went took the finalized uh, brochures over to Jack Harris. Yep. And Elizabeth, uh, the three of us went over them. Yep. And we had a meeting with the IT guy that's running their website right now. Yeah. And it looks like I'm going to wind up starting to take over yeah. some of that or more of that. Yeah, that's correct. And after that, we went shopping. Yes, after shopping, we eat lunch. And then in the afternoon, we went to church. I got to serve in the kids' ministry and attend also the service. Which was actually really cool. Yes. With our business schedule, we need to put God in the center and oh, everything. Definitely. And then after that, we went to another F Filipino event. It's actually a Filipino club of Arizona in partnership with the Phil... No, Philippine Filipino Club of Arizona. Arizona. Phil Lion, Lion Lions Club, club and the whole associations. Okay. Yeah, it was really cool. They have folk dances, singing Christmas songs, nativity, and dancing. Who, who was it that invited us? Uh, Tita Angie. She's super sweet. 
lady and I got to see Ati Zenny and Tony. I got more, Dr. Pam who cleaned my teeth first when I moved here. So yeah, I was really cool. I got to see a lot of people that I know and then the food are really good. Yes. So of course they have fish. They have buffet style. Yeah. And they had beef for the, for the Canos. Fish for me, so. It Fish works. for the Filipinos and beef for the Canos. Yeah, it worked, it worked really well. So, yeah, and then this morning we got to have, we got a chance to do, or go to work for the, what do you call that? Adopt a family. So, me and John, um, we deliver the gifts that we adopt. So, the project that we have at work, we call it Adopt a Family. So, uh, whatever the parents or the mother or father and the kids want. So, we're actually granting their wish lists. So we're like Santa Claus. <laughs> Isn't that cool? And then, yeah, um, so my team, my supervisor bought all the uh, gifts and then my team donated some clothes and uh, whatever uh, they have that they think that mo would uh, use for, for the family. And yeah, get a chance to meet the family and the mother is kind of shy, she's just smiling. Because, um, yeah, she speaks Spanish. She don't really speak English. I don't and think she spoke any English. Yeah, very minimal. yeah, and the kid entertained. So it was really cool. And yep, we have a really, aside from that, we have a really intense communication issue last night and yes, this morning. So that. In the near future, uh, probably in February, after Cindy's work calms down and her class schedule backs off, we're going to start doing periodic tip videos. That over the last three years, we've came up with, we, we've discovered oh, tons tools and techniques to help usually head off the communication issues that we've had. Yeah. And, yeah. In three years, we've we've never really had a, a disagreement, other than just communication issues. Yeah. That with most fam with most couples, money is a huge issue. Yeah. To fight over, and we've never really fought over money. Yeah. It's most of the. We've had some um, intense discussions because of communication issues. That's correct. <laughs> Learning to deal with tempo. Yeah, and learning learn to stop to, tempo. And you learn to be how to lumbing. Yeah, we don't do that. No, oh, you're persistent. This morning, you really did a great job saying, wait, wait for me. So, yeah, it's actually really cool. Um, um, it's mostly the reason we have a communication issue is because I'm not paying attention or like I'm not listening actively or active listening. <laughs> That's one part. Like I feel like I heard it and then I will say I never heard what you said. And then I just, I, I don't know. Maybe you said something, he said something, but I just, it doesn't stick into my brain. And that's one thing the what the start of our issue like our communication issue it's because of me not paying attention so much to what you said or just how i interpret it's like it's like a telephone like <laughs> it's like relaying a message i feel like my brain doesn't really the message well <laughs> i'm listening it but it doesn't really well it's like the how you interpret it just doesn't really interpret it because like you know so it was just and part of it was just that I didn't communicate terribly well and verify that communication was understood. Yeah. And it's usually those times that when we assume the other one understands something the same way we intended it, that things tend to magnify and get out of control. And yeah. uh, we have end up with some intense discussions. Yeah. <laughs> but... This is the first, this is really the first fight we've had in couple, a long time. Yeah. A couple months, at least. Yeah. Three, four months. Six. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah. Which that's actually a good thing. <laughs> it's but, just because of the busyness and a lot of stress from, you know, like. Just, a lot of it's that, the, the, the stress that this time of year puts on it and 
we haven't really had time to unpack and be we just us to, in a while. We need to plan Friday out. night was actually a pretty cool thing to, to just not have any yeah. pressure, stress, or have to get this done, that done, or be ready to get this next thing done. So Yeah. I'm more of like... Americans put way too much stress in, in Christmas season. I see. Yeah. I put so much stress on you, too. But anyways, yeah. Um, what else? Um, we got to... Uh, oh, we finished printing out the brochure and give it to Elizabeth. And we have that Zone Lion meeting, which just came from. So, yeah, that's our actually our week. How it the flow and everything. Now this week you've planned uh, Wednesday or Thursday you're going to get your flex day so you'll be getting off way early. Yeah, either early or coming early. <laughs> and there's actually a discount theater Yeah. right close to where she works, right in between where we live and her work. So we're probably going to do a dinner at Applebee's and yeah, we, you know what, we could do that on Wednesday, no, not Wednesday, because I have an assignment, that's my last time, so we could do that Thursday, and then watch. Hopefully, you're th I, thought I thought I saw it on, thir on Wednesday, Wednesday this week, you were thinking it was Thursday, I'll so. check my schedule, I plan it. can ask him, hey, can you please make it on Thursday for me, please? They can do that, too. I'm, they really always do a lot of flex to me, because I'm one of... <laughs> It's supposed to be, I need to come in early Friday, but I said, hey, I cannot do that because I have a really special client, the one that I told you, she's lone and lunatic. <laughs> and she said, pinky square, you do it correctly. <laughs> yeah, and um, her son had a, a fiance in the Philippines and yeah, we get a share. She's one of my favorite clients, but she's just one of my favorite. TLC client, tender loving care client, but hey, you need to do that. client. Yes, she's one of those. She's super nice. She just like, she just bug you all the time. Hey, did you do that? Did you do this? Did you do this? But I love her. She's super nice in a pesty sort of way. <laughs> but she's nice, so. But anyways. We will talk with you next week. Yes. And look out Wednesday for weekends on Wednesday that all the activities we did this weekend will get posted. edited, compiled, and posted on Wednesday and flashback Friday. And also, you could check our um, website. Um, yep, we started that website too. Our we blog. We started a, yeah. our blog. That I'll post a link to that down below. Okay, yeah. And we will talk with you next, next week. week. Oh, next week is Christmas Day. Christmas Eve. Oh yeah, you're right. So Monday's we, Christmas Day. So we didn't. We can may we may just we skip may, this. We may we, we may have Monday night chica chica on Tuesday next week. I'm yeah, not sure. So we could skip that one. Guess we, we will won't go. Skip it. We won't skip it. But, but we just may do it on Tuesday because we'll go to your sister, <coughs> um, for the Christmas and, and Christmas, Christmas Eve is. is we got a church because my friends at church are inviting me. What do you want to eat for breakfast? I will get. And I said, if I'll say want to do it, of course, I want to have rice. And she's loving. <laughs> but anyways, that's our, our recap and our chica chica. Um, salamat. Mabuhay. Maligayang Pasco. Maligayang Pasco. Salamat. Feliz All that fun stuff. Salamat. Bye-bye. <laughs>